folks and welcome to Barrick Mitsubishi. My name is Austin Johnson and it's a pleasure to have you today as we do a comprehensive walk around video on this 2013 Toyota Kluger Grande. Alright guys, so let's go ahead and start on the exterior of our Toyota Kluger. So guys, as we take a look at the front end here, we see that we have a really nice metallic black paint on the vehicle, which just really gives it a fantastic look and really makes it stand out in the sun. And guys, we have that really, really nice breakup coming in our front grille as well, with the nice gray and silver accents, and that really nice chrome accenting on our Toyota badge just located right there in the middle. Now as you can see guys, we do have the nice swooped in headlights coming across the front of the vehicle, and this vehicle does have the fog lights already installed for you with that nice silver accenting around the outside as well. Now guys, we do have a nice amount of ground clearance and as far as the condition of the front end of the vehicle goes guys, it's really really good overall. Not seeing any major stone chips or marks. Now we do have some minor scratching on the side panel here, but other than that presents really really nicely guys. And as we take a stop at that first premium alloy wheel, we do find a wheel that's in absolutely fantastic condition guys. As you can see going around the wheel here, we have absolutely no gutter rashing or marking and it's paired with a nice new tread attire for you. Now guys, we do have our blinker indicator just located here with our color matching side mirrors just here. Nice chrome grande badging here with some nice chrome accenting going across the bottom. Also some really nice chrome accenting on our door handles here as well guys. Now as you can see we do have the keyless entry so with just the touch of a button we can go ahead and pop the doors open on this vehicle as well. Now guys as we come down the driver's side here really really good condition overall once again just some minor scratching going down the side of the vehicle but other than that really really fantastic condition. Now as you can see we do have the privacy glass on the rear of the vehicle but the main thing that I would recommend is to go ahead and get these two front windows tinted. Really make this vehicle look better stick out even more with that nice black black metallic paint and the chrome accenting and also just better for practicality reasons as well guys. Now coming to that second premium alloy wheel, we do find another wheel that's in absolutely fantastic condition, sticks with that theme, no marking or gutter rashing at all. Now coming to the back end of our Kluger here guys, we're going to notice that we have the really nice big swooping in tail lights on this vehicle, just gives it a fantastic look with some nice chrome accenting going across the back. Now we do have a nice skid guard here, so that way when we're pulling and loading things in and out of our lift gate here, it's not going to scratch up the paint on the vehicle. Now guys, this vehicle does have the reverse camera which is just located here and once again this is an all wheel drive or V6 engine, we do have the badging just located there. Now popping open the boot here guys. You see how much space we have. Now this is a seven seater vehicle. So with the seats down, you see how much extra space we have there. And with the seats up, we still have a nice amount of room and we have that third row available as well. We do have two cup holders on each side guys, and we can drop our seats down just by pulling the handles here or pulling the ropes on the top. Either way, it's gonna get it done. Now we do have a 12 volt socket just located here. And overall, just a really, really nice amount of space in the boot of this Kluger. Now this is a power lift gate, so with just a touch of a button, it's gonna beep to let us know it's coming up or down, and it's gonna go ahead and close down and lock itself right up for you. Now coming around to the passenger side of the Kluger, guys, we'll go ahead and take a look at the third premium alloy wheel, which sticks with that theme of absolutely perfect condition. No gutter rashing or marking on the wheel at all, so really, really fantastic to see, guys. Now we do have our petrol filler cap just located handily here, and once again, nice chrome accenting going across the door handles and across the bottom of the vehicle. Really, really good condition down the passenger side as well, guys. Once again, the only thing I'm really finding on this vehicle is just some minor scratches going down the side. And where it is a darker paint, it just shows up a little more, but nothing a good buff can help out. Now, guys, once again, nice chrome grande badging here with our color matching side mirror, blinker indicator here. And as we take a look at that last premium alloy wheel, guys, just sticking with that theme of absolutely perfect condition, no gutter rashing or marking on the wheel at all, paired with a nice shredded tire for you. Now, guys, what I'm going to do now that we finished up the exterior of the Kluger, let's go ahead and pop the bond on the vehicle and we'll go through the internals and the specifica specifications I'm sorry on this V6 engine so let's do that now All right, guys, so as we take a look underneath our bonnet here, we see that we're just really fantastic condition here. Just absolutely clean all the way through the engine bay. We have that nice V6 and Toyota badging on top of our engine there, and we do have a nice new battery with hardly any corrosion on the points at all. So guys, what we're looking at here is a 3.5 liter six cylinder petrol engine that produces 201 kilowatts of power and 357 newt meters of torque. It is backed by a five speed automatic transmission and we're looking pretty good on our fuel economy in a V8 
vehicle of this size as well, guys. If you're looking around 11.6 liters per 100 Ks driven, and you're looking around 800 kilometers driven on a full tank of petrol in this vehicle. Now, guys, on top of that, we have some really, really nice safety ratings in our Kluger as well. You do have a five-star ANCAP safety rating and seven standard airbags. So for the children, for the family, just an absolutely fantastic vehicle. Now, guys, if you're needing to do any type of towing at all, it will get the job done for you as well. You do have around 2,000 kilograms of towing capacity in the Kluger as well. So what I'm going to do now for you guys is let's go ahead and pop the bonnet back down. And now that we've finished with the exterior and the internal features under the bonnet here, we're going to go ahead and pop to the inside of our Kluger and we'll go through the interior and the specifications on the vehicle on the inside. So let's go ahead and do that now. Guys, so as we move into the interior of the Kluger here, we see that everything's in really, really fantastic condition on the inside, and it's just super luxurious and spacious overall. Now, this is a push-to-start vehicle, guys, so let's go ahead and give the vehicle a start here. We just put our fo foot on the brake. Go ahead and hit the button there, and it's going to start right up for us. Now, guys, I'm going to get some air going in here. It's a little bit warm outside. Let's go ahead and get this air going, guys, and I will tell you that it works absolutely fantastically. Nice touchscreen system as well, guys, just really responsive to the touch. Sorry guys, one moment here. All right, so now as we take a look at our features on the inside of the Kluger here, guys, we'll go ahead and start on the driver's side of the vehicle. And as we start on the driver's side door, we're gonna notice that we have some really nice black and beige trim throughout, nice and leather wrapped all the way through the vehicle. And we do have some nice wood grain accenting as well, just really giving it that luxurious look and just an absolutely fantastic feel. Looking over here, we do have all of our automatic window controls on our driver door, along with our uh, automatic door locking controls as well, and our side mirror adjustments just up top here. Now guys, we do have some illumination controls, and we also have our power liftgate button on the inside just here. Now that's also located on the key fob, guys, so with just the push of a button, we can lift up our liftgate and go ahead and close it down as well. Now guys, taking a look at the steering wheel itself, it's really, really nicely round shaped and just super nice leather wrapped, hardly any marking on it, and it's really, really comfortable to the touch. And just has a really really nice design point now taking a look at the left side we have our bluetooth and infotainment system controls with our uh sorry with our cruise control settings on the right side of the steering wheel and they're just located at the bottom right here now on our right stick over here guys we do have our headlight and fog light controls along with our blinker indicators now this vehicle does have the automatic headlight feature which is a fantastic feature to have and on the left stick over here guys we do have our front and rear windscreen wiper settings just located there now taking a look at the instrument cluster itself guys just an absolutely fantastic fantastic sporty look guys for a vehicle that's done around 159,000 k's it really doesn't present that way at all it's so nice so comfortable in here and just an absolutely fantastic and luxurious vehicle on the inside now moving to the middle of our Kluger here guys we see a nice information center just up top here showing us the outside temperature and the time as well and just below that guys we do have that nice touchscreen infotainment system really really responsive to the touch nice clear view as well and just really really easy to use as you can see the sat nav is um, included with this and you can see the map pulled up at the moment we do have our power and volume controls on the right turn knob here with our tuning controls just on the left with hard buttons all around and we do have our hazard control lighting just located here and just below our screen here guys we do have our climate control system now this vehicle does have the dual climate control so we can set a temperature for each side of the vehicle and it's just really really nice and easy to use with our temperature settings on each side our fan speed and modes just located directly in the middle now below here guys we do have a 12 volt socket just located here and we do have the heated seat functions on the driver and passenger seat with an auxiliary port just located handily here dual cup holders with some chrome accenting around the edges and as you can see we have that nice wood grain going all the way through once again now guys nice automatic shifter as i pop it into reverse we're going to notice that reverse camera pop up on the screen which just is a absolutely fantastic clear view so whether you're backing in and out of tight spaces or backing up to a trailer it's going to make that an absolute breeze for you guys now as we come down in our regular drive we can slap that over into a sport drive mode so we can actually shift gears on our own if we choose to do so Another 12 volt socket here with a snow mode and downhill ascent control located handily there. As we flip up here, we do find another set of cup holders. So we have four cup holders in the front here. And guys, as I pop open the center console, we see that it's really nice and deep, an ample amount of space. And we do have a remote control here for our rear entertainment as well. We do have a nice DVD system in this vehicle pops right down so if you're going on a long trip you have the kids or any family members with you absolutely fantastic feature to have guys it's going to keep them entertained during the trip just a really really good feature to have overall 
So guys, what I'm going to do now is just have my camera person pan around the inside of the vehicle just a little better, let you get a look at this, these really nice beige leather seats and just how great the condition is, of this vehicle is. And as we take a look up top, guys, the one thing I haven't pointed out yet is we do have a nice sunroof, which we can either tilt up or down. And of course, guys, as well, we can slide that sunroof all the way open. So just an absolutely fantastic feature to have, really just to put the icing on the cake on this Kluger. Just so many nice, luxurious features in this vehicle. As I go ahead and shut up the cover now. And guys, as you're painting around the interior here, I'm gonna go ahead and get this service history together for you guys. And as we take a look here, guys, the vehicle's been serviced really, really well overall. We've had almost all of our services done right on time. One or two missing here or there, um, but every one of them been stamped and serviced right on time, guys, and it has been serviced with us. We did do an intermediate service on it when it came in here to Barrick Mitsubishi and took care of that for you as well. So guys, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna hop in the rear seating of the Kluger, and I'll show you how much space we have in that second row and show you the features in the rear of the vehicle as well. All right, guys, so moving to the rear seat of our Kluger, guys, just an absolutely ton of space here. We have a ton of headroom, Really nice amount of legroom and a bunch of storage for our passengers in the rear as well. Storage on the back seats and storage on each side of the door. Nice deep spaces and cup holders as well with grab handles on each side. And we do have our own air conditioning vents in the rear as well with our own climate control settings just here in the rear. As I pop this down, guys, on the inside here, we do have cup holders and a storage tray that slides right out. So really, really nice feature to have. And then as well as that, guys, we do have another set of cup holders. So we have four cup holders for the rear here as well. Now, guys, these leather seats are super, super plush and comfortable. And each side has its own armrest that drops down, which just makes it fantastic for long trips. Now, on top of that, guys, we can adjust where these seats are in the rear just by pulling a lever underneath and sliding them back and forth. So, guys, just a fantastic amount of space back here. Super comfortable overall and so many amenities and features even in the rear seating of this Toyota Kluger. All right, guys, so now that we have finished up with the rear seating of our Kluger here, let's take a look once again at the outside of this vehicle, guys. It just presents really, really nicely. As you expect with a Grande Edition, just so many nice, luxurious features in this vehicle, and it's going to get the job done for you no matter what you're using this vehicle for. This is an absolutely fantastic family car. Great for work, great for family, long trips, everyday use. It's going to get the job done, and if you're looking for something that gives you all of the bells and whistles, all of the nice features that you want in a vehicle, this is the one for you at a fantastic value. Now guys, even though we've done around 155,000 Ks on our Kluger here, it's in such fantastic condition that it actually qualifies for our premium mechanical protection plan. Now this premium mechanical protection plan covers you for five years or 200,000 Ks. It covers 181 components on the vehicle. And on top of that, you get 10 years, 200,000 Ks of platinum roadside assist with this premium mechanical protection plan as well. So guys, if you would like to look more into the premium mechanical protection plan, please just click the link in the description below and we will actually take you through a walk through video a step-by-step -step video to show you through that plan so guys once again my name is Austin Johnson it's been an absolute pleasure to have you with me today I hope I've answered any questions that you have on the Toyota Kluger Grande and guys it's just been an absolute pleasure so with that I say Barrick Mitsubishi customer experience is where we thrive so please give us a call at 9907-055